Hey all, and welcome to another one of my YouTube videos. Thanks for tuning in, and I hope you're all having the day you deserve. Today we're going to be going to, just for a day trip out of Taipei, to Shifan Falls. It's going to be about a two, two and a half, a half hour, because we got to get to Taipei Main Station. Then we hop on the train and uh, really looking forward to getting out of the city and up in the mountains. So let's see how this goes. Yeah, just a little information on, on how you get to Shifan Falls. You find your way to Taipei Main Station, which is you can either go on the blue line or the red line. They both take you there. Then you look for, it's all marked uh, very, very well. You look for uh, TSA, get your train ticket. You can, you can even use your easy card, not wait in any lineups. And you go to platform four. So we were lucky enough uh, to get here and hop on the train and it's going already, so we're on our way. We uh, decided to stop at Hao Tong, which is a cat-themed village, which sort of caters to cats. So we decided to check it out. Most of the shops here are all cat themed. Let's have a look inside this one. that if you do come up here and you have a chance to come up on a weekday I would suggest it this is Saturday and it is packed Just explain uh, what what this is here. Peanut powder with ice cream, ice cream roll. And and what is this part here made out of? Flour, flour. Just flour, and yeah. then you have a peanut, which I see your friend is shaving. Is it like caramelized? Uh, okay, so it's got some coriander. Okay, so we got ice cream, peanut, and flour. 
And there it is. So here it is. So about the coriander whether it would go because it's a dessert but it does taste very good Give it a thumbs up yeah i'm about to walk on this really long amazing looking suspension bridge and just compared to vancouver canada where i live we have a suspension bridge and the last time i did it was maybe 10 12 years ago and it costs 40 american dollars here in taiwan Everything's free, so uh, that's you know such a great difference uh, and uh, an amazing thing here in Taiwan. What they don't charge you for anything. a little different than the ones we normally have in North America. Um, I remember having these in Yamingshan and they were just really delicious so excited to try it. Yeah. yeah we got through the old street and all the crowds and uh, now we're on our way to the wa waterfalls. There's a few different ways you can go to get there. You can uh, you can hire a scooter, rent one, or you can take a taxi. We decided to walk We've been here before. We, it's like a 20 minute walk and it's beautiful scenery. So this is what we've decided. Yeah, if you're not sure exactly if you're going the right way to get to the waterfall, you walk down the old street and then you see it'll clear up a bit, not so many people. And you see the parking lot with all the buses and then you'll get to this building here sort of a semicircle building. Once you get here, you know you're on the right track and you just follow the crowd. You walk down the stairs and uh, you're, you're gonna be getting pretty close. sort of a, a semi-circle this waterfall which kind of gives it a bit of a 3d look but isn't that beautiful wow
little bits of finger food here and there, a little taste of Taiwan. These are uh, octopus balls. Not literally, but they're, they're, they're shaped like round and they're made of octopus. An octopus has three hearts and nine brains, which always makes me a little guilty eating them. They're just so damn delicious. I just going to explain the colors of the lantern, so what you write. Go ahead, Judy. It's orange for love, marriage, white for bright future, purple for studying tests, blue for promotion career, yellow for honey, money and wealth, and red for health, pink for happiness, and green for everything. I got success. Okay. Kind of gives you an idea. They have the stands where you can write what you need to write. Yellow, I think, is health. Pink is uh, money. Ah, I'm just guessing. Uh, longevity. I don't know what any of this means. All Chinese, but this is where you do it. I guess this is going to wrap up my video of uh, Shifan Falls and the Old Street. I really hope you enjoyed it and if you did and you want to subscribe I would certainly accept that and help me make it to my very very modest goal of a thousand subscribers. Um, it was it was just wonderful, it never rained, it sort of threatened. It was supposed to be sunny all day but uh, that kind of fell through. But. What a beautiful waterfall. I've heard people say this is the nicest waterfall in uh, Taiwan. I don't know if I would go that far because I've seen some beautiful waterfalls, but um, I don't know if I've seen one nicer. But, uh, you know, so uh, thank you very much for watching. I, I hope you enjoyed it. And I want you all to have a good day and uh, peace out.